Hello everyone and welcome to another Star Wars Old Republic video and for this video I'm just going to be talking about how to get cheap armor sets off the GTN. Now as you guys can see here in the chat I've picked up a few armor sets that were going for very cheap and basically what was happening was I was just browsing the GTN randomly and one thing that I like to do and one thing maybe you want to think about doing as well is I just go on the GTN and in the search uh, place I just type in armor set. And what that does is that brings up all the armor sets that are available on the GTN at that moment in time. I will I just sort through via price and as you guys can see I was picking up some really nice armor sets that were going for very cheap prices. And the reason these things are going for so cheap right now, and you'll see me doing that uh, armor set search and then sorting by price, is because um, the Galactic Legends cartel pack was recently on the cartel market and that cartel pack dropped full armor sets that were very nice that are basically from the Galactic Legends. So characters from Kotar 1 and Kotar 2 and their armor sets have basically just been transferred to this game. And so um, I'm going to be searching up some of those armor sets here as well and you'll see that they're actually going for very very cheap prices. The reason being with these new um, cartel packs being available the market became really flooded. And so um, as you guys can see gold armor sets here going for under a million that normally sell for like two, three, four million credits uh, beforehand. So a great time to buy low sell high but also a great time just to collect and you'll see me here get a really really good deal the mandalore the preserver's armor set i recently actually just picked up this armor set for my mercenary and i paid a good seven million credits for it and here you can see the entire armor set going for just under two million credits and the chest piece going for seven hundred and fifty thousand credits and this is a very very nice mandalorian armor set so very cheap an awesome deal and um i'm pretty sure that like considering these auctions were actually available for some time that maybe there were actually a lot of armor sets going for that price and the cheaper ones actually got bought up and this was one of the more expensive ones that was left remaining so you guys can see that there are some really good deals here and so the point of this video is how to get cheap armor sets is number one you know search up via armor sets as you guys can see there um, like if you see an armor set going for very cheap like Mandalore the Preserver then you might also want to check the individual armor pieces and see whether those are going for cheap as well because normally when the armor set's going for cheap those individual pieces are going for cheap and secondly um, one thing that you might want to think about is let's say you're hunting for a particular armor piece so let's say you were hunting for the chest piece or the helmet of a very expensive armor set one thing you might want to actually do is look for the entire armor set itself because often enough the individual armor pieces are selling for actually more than the entire armor set. So you can actually get more pieces, more value for a much cheaper price. And conversely, if you had the entire armor set in your inventory and you wanted to sell it on the GTN, I would recommend selling it as individual pieces rather than the entire armor set. And uh, now since the Galactic Legends packs are no longer available on the cartel market, you might be wondering what is the relevance of this video? Well, we now recently, just for this weekend, we have the Grand Nightlife pack available. And that Grand Nightlife pack drops basically the same thing as the Galactic Legends packs. It drops really old and valuable cartel market armor sets. Uh, the ones to note are, for example, Mandalore the Ultimate. It drops... Um, you know, the Euphora Corellian armor set, uh, Karnas Moore's armor set, and a whole range of other really nice things that are right now selling for very, very expensive prices. But when these items start to unbound from the people who have opened them, they will start flooding the GTN. And it will be a great time to look at those armor sets and buy them for cheap prices. Once again, if you want to buy low, sell high, it's a great time to do so. Or if you just want to collect it for yourself. I personally couldn't believe the deals I was finding on some of these really awesome armor sets just because the Galactic Legends packs were available for a rather short time. And so that does mean that the Grand Nightlife packs are most likely going to affect the economy in a similar way. And then also in the future when these packs are removed, the prices are going to go up so you can sell them if you bought them at low prices or you can wait for Bioware to keep releasing these types of special cartel packs. There are numerous types that they do. We have the gold armor packs uh, which are of note. Uh, now it's actually been data mined that we're getting new types of grand packs which I'll talk about in another video. But the bottom line is these types of packs which recycle these old uh, items are very very common and oftentimes when they do come on the cartel market they really drop the prices on the GTN and it is a great great time to, to browse for these and look for them. So right now, these are the armor sets to note and in the future, look for uh, these good deals. Uh, the, gra the Dark Horses Light Packs, those are another really great example. Those dropped this prices of some of the rarest armor sets in the game very, very low. Well, not armor sets, but like the Cathar Honor Sword, I picked up that for 4 million credits. I picked up the Volatile Conqueror's Lightsaber for under, Volatile Conqueror's Dual Saber for under 2 million credits. The prices just hit hard. And look at this Atrus's armor set. This is one thing that I wanted to highlight. I picked this up for under 500k credits, and look how nice that armor set is. I remember getting that armor set from a Grand Chance Cube once and selling it on the GTN for like 3 million credits. 
So you can imagine that right now, that going for under 400,000 credits is an amazing deal. And it could be very profitable in the future if you pick it up. And look at some of this other stuff, the Miraz armor set, going for a little bit too expensive right now. But, um, but you, know, you can always wait for the prices to drop. So anyways, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video about how to get cheap and low armor sets. Definitely you guys should be browsing the GTN and when you see these deals hit the cartel market, it's a great time to check to make sure that you are getting those good deals on the GTN because oftentimes it gets flooded. I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. I wish you guys luck in your hunting for armor sets and I'll see you in the next one.